Here is the result. Tan skin. Finally. I know like I know like I know like I know. <laughs> is he seeing something we're not seeing? Please. Please. Someone help. Someone help. Hey guys, it's your girl Courtney and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm back with a brand new video and um, do I look different? I got my lashes done. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. So today we're going to be watching this. This is a kiss channel. This is a kiss channel. Yes. And yes, you guessed it. It's Troom Troom. Troom Troom. How many Troom Troom channels are there? We have Troom Troom. We have Troom Troom Trick. We have Troom Troom Select. We have Troom Troom Wow. We have Troom Troom Day. We have... Jesus. If I could describe Troom Troom in three images, this is what I would describe it as. <laughs> Take that as you will. I haven't done a Troom Troom video in a couple months, but the last one I did still haunts me in my sleep. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Wait. At this point, I think this is self-sabotage because we're gonna watch more Trum Trum today. <laughs> if you don't know what Trum Trum is, it's basically a kid's channel that focuses on decreasing the IQ of its viewers with every single upload. How do I say this? <laughs> How do I say this in a nice way? There's some things that you watch in your everyday life and you're like, wow, I feel a little bit smarter. You know, I feel empowered, inspired, intellectual. You feel that type of energy, you know, when you watch certain types of content. And then there's other content that's like, I think my life would have been better if I didn't watch this. Yeah. And Trim Trim falls under that category. <laughs> Trim Trim is honestly very similar to Five Minute Crafts. If you don't know what Five Minute Crafts is. That's a summary. That's a summary. This video is going to be the types of people at the beach. And honestly, I don't go to the beach because one, I'm boring. Also, I don't know how to swim. So I'm not trying to drown mm -mm. or get attacked by a shark and die, die. Anyways, they definitely reeled us in with this thumbnail. So let's see what the video is giving. And also, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I, I just realized I never introduced y'all to my, if you're new to my channel, thank you so much for coming. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. And thank you so much for being a Reezy. Yep. The new people don't know about that. Reezys are the best people on the internet, literally. And the only way you can become a Reezy is if you hit the subscribe button. Do it. I cannot believe this is actually the thumbnail. <laughs> okay, so the video starts off with showing somebody that's going to the beach to just get a tan. They'll do anything to get a perfect result. They need the sun to touch their whole body. Here is the result. Tan skin, finally. I know, like I know, like I know, like I know. I know that they. they <laughs> I'm stuttering. <laughs> I know they did not just start the video like this. Why did he become a black man? Can someone explain that to me? And it's the fact that he's not even evenly tanned. What is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? I can still see the Caucasian in some spots. You know what, Trump Trump, this is not the first time y'all have done this. I don't know why y'all like playing around with black fishing. It's very weird, it's very bizarre. I just don't understand. I don't understand yet. This man became black. There's no tan in this world. I know a lot of y'all will try and be like, well, you know, there's some people that got a little bit of Italian in them. That's what. <laughs> Who are you trying to fool? <laughs> Who are you trying to fool? He went from looking like this to looking like, oh. Like this. Oh, he needs some look milk. at look at look at this look at his hairline y'all literally sprayed this man's hairline this is disrespectful hold on let's see the comments because the comments better not be foolish thanks again for all your own range of products and services to the top of my life in times of crisis in the world of good news for me to the top of my own and make i think i just had a stroke i think i just had a stroke what did i just read thanks again for all of your own range of products and services to the top of my life in times of crisis Jeez. Is it me? Am I the problem? Am I the Bessie? Bessie! Anyways, let's go on. Let's move on to the next thing because you have already started being foolish. Okay, so we have this man that literally just comes to the beach to eat food, which I get it. How are you still hungry? Dang! Ugh, here they are, my treasures. 
Hum nom nom nom. Lunch while swimming. Yeah. Going into the beach water with food is another level of dirtiness that I just can't, I can't understand. I can't understand. You're telling me you couldn't wait? You couldn't wait to get into the water? Thing is the best. Hey, stop splashing. You telling them to stop splashing? Why did you go in? Why did you go in, John? I'm gonna just call you John. Just cuz. And then we have the people that go to the beach just to take photos, which I get it. I get it. That will probably be me. I'm not gonna lie. Cuz, um, I won't get in the water, but I will take photos. Show passion. More emotion. Everything has to be as natural as possible. Oh, almost like in a shampoo commercial. Okay, that was kind of good. I'm not even gonna lie. Salt is very different than we imagine. Baywatch is nothing compared to this. It seems like even her friend is a little jealous. Whoops, what did you do? This is an important lesson. Watch your friends. Look at her. Look, at, look at how happy she is that she popped her friend's boob. Who said anything about being real? Uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. This is giving me very much eyelash girl. I don't know if y'all know about the eyelash girl. Literally, they were making a video together, and the girl was looking good, popping, whatever, looking like a baddie. And then her friend was watching her remove the lashes. Why would you do that? What would compel you to do that? Don't sabotage your friends, guys. And then we have the prankster. I'm going to swim. Give me a towel. Finally, <sighs> peace and quiet. Why y'all sharing the towel? Now you sleeping on bare sand. And I see some rocks. I know your back hurt. <laughs> you can relax and rest. The prankster is on his way. Why not bury her? It'll be so funny. Oh, hey, you're back already, honey? Why are you mad? I thought all girls wanted to have a bigger chest. Yeah. <laughs> what kind of deep sleep did you enter? What kind of deep sleep did you enter where you literally did not feel him putting sand on your body? Also, how did you even get into that deep sleep? You're sleeping on bare sand, babe. Not even bare sand, because there's rocks. But the prankster can't be stopped. Pull on the rope. Oh no! Do you stop? Do you rest? Do you rest? At this point, it's harassment. At this point, it is harassment. Leave my good sis alone. First, she was trying to take a nap, you interrupted. She's trying to swim, you interrupted. Can you go and sleep? Can you go and rest? Oops, where's my bikini bottom? Phew, I found it. Keep laughing. She's coming back and you're going to regret it. Okay, I don't even know why this is being promoted on a kid's channel. It's not like, this is, it's not funny. Don't feel inspired to do this. This is rude, this is harassment and you're not supposed to touch anybody without permission. That's how you get killed. And then we have the desperate guy. That's not only a beach thing. <laughs> That wasn't funny. I'm sorry, that, that wasn't even funny at all. <laughs> the target is selected. The hunter is ready. Hey baby, what's up? Boy, you know you too close. Back up, <laughs> back up, back up. Don't girls like persistent guys? Boy, if you don't- She moved away from you and you came back. Remove yourself immediately, immediately. Yeah. Get out of here, jerk. You're confused, you're confused. Continue being confused. But not everyone comes to the beach to find a soulmate. But he can't be stopped. Y'all, I cannot. <laughs> Miss girl is just trying to watch the sunset. She's just trying to watch the sunset and then we have an animal. Me, Baby, do you want me to be your kitty? My kitty? This beautiful girl is allergic to animals. He failed again. But persistence is- Why did you even try? How are you gonna kiss somebody's hand without saying hi? Get yourself out of here with your stupid self. And then we have the guy who is always swimming. I cannot relate. I feel like if I knew how to swim, I would be a swimmer. I would be swimming, bro. Good thing a real swimmer doesn't need anyone. In his past life, he could have been a shark. His friends have already packed up to go home, and he is still splashing around in the water. And he won't stop. He will come out when it's dark. What is that? What is that? Wait, it's... Bro, we, no, y'all, no. That is something you would see in a nightmare. Why does he look like that? Why does he look like that? Sai, you are frightening. You are frightening. And then we have the couple who go to the beach. I think that's pretty typical. And so basically the guy writes, I love you on the sand in hopes of surprising his girlfriend. And some random guy comes and changes the words to, I hate you. He shows the girlfriend. This is their reaction. <laughs> I hate you? 
Oh no! You broke my heart! I broke mine too! What a nightmare! Our relationship is in danger! Why are you crying? Why are you crying? Why are you crying? At your big age, you can't just say, oh no, somebody changed the letters. You cannot do that. You're here crying. What a Boy, if you don't change the letters back to love, change it! Change it! How can writing on the sand end a relationship like this? It wasn't strong to begin with. Y'all might as well break up. Break up. Something's wrong. Something is wrong. <laughs> and then we have the person that comes to the beach to take a shower. You are nasty. <laughs> you are dirty. Okay. Lots of people swim in the ocean, but only the smartest ones bring bath accessories. A loofah, body wash, and a shower cap. Kill two birds with one stone. That's perfect. You can swim and have a nice bath. Well. I know he woke up with a bacterial infection on his face. I know he woke up with a bacterial infection the next day. Because this is something, this is dirty. This is dirty. The water is brown. Because it is beach water. I mean, there's some beaches that have clear water, but this one is brown. This one is brown. You know, when you're at home and the water turns brown, do you use it? Look, I, I think we need to think critically. Some people are always on the lookout. After all, danger is everywhere. Especially in the sea. Look out, waves! Boy, what are you about to do? I'm going to get you! The most important thing for a fighter Where are is you a running? reaction. Take that! I know this boy is not fighting the water. Y'all. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I see. You attack the wrong person. Do you give up? That's right. I'm a wave tamer. And now. Y'all. Y'all, please. Just imagine this. Imagine you're casually tanning. Casually just enjoying your time at the beach. You turn to your left and you see someone fighting the water. I would be scared. I don't even know what to say because I would be scared. I'd be like, hold on, this person's fine in the water. Does he see something we don't see? <laughs> Is he seeing something we're not seeing? Please, please, someone help, someone help. The way that would just instantly ruin my mood, I can literally be in the most relaxed state ever and then now you've just increased my anxiety because you're seeing something that I'm not seeing. You're fighting water. You're fighting water and expecting to win. If you've been in a hurricane, you know the power that water has. I wouldn't play with it if I were you. Mm, I wouldn't do it. I've literally been in a hurricane where my whole entire street was flooded. I was scared for my life. I really was. Hurricane Harvey, survivor. That was scary. Very scary. I feel like we have a hurricane like every year now. Relax. Mother nature, please relax. And now it's snowing in Texas. Nah, I gotta, I need to get out of here. So this was Trum Trum's video on types of people at the beach. Okay, I didn't forget about the Caucasian man turning into a black man. I did not forget about that. I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. Make sure to follow me on my Instagram and honestly, follow me on my Snapchat too. Like I think, yeah, follow me on my Snapchat. I don't really promote my Snapchat that much, but like, I guess if you watch this video, now you know my Snapchat. And my Twitter, you know what? Just follow me everywhere. But anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. Make sure to follow me on all my social media. I will see you guys all in my next one. I love you and peace.